ABF Husseini, there you heard him talking to Benny Sabubedu Lansa, and we're focusing a lot more on those stories here on, Joy, on the Joy News channel. Talking about security, the Ghana Armed Forces has today launched a simulation exercise called named Exercise Eastern Shield to prepare security forces for next month's crucial elections. The exercise is in partnership with the police service, the fire service, as well as other allied security agencies. General Officer Commanding of the of the Southern Command of the Ghana Armed Forces, Brigadier General Yabua Nsia, launched the exercise at the command headquarters in Teshi this morning. Join News' reporter Kwekwa Sante is joining me with more. Hello, Kweku. Tell us what exactly, uh, how exactly this operation uh, is supposed to be, is supposed to run. Hello, can you please come again? The, the question is not I can't hear you. Okay, I'm hoping you can hear me now. What more did the officers tell you about the shape of this particular exercise? Well, so the Brigadier General of the Southern Command, the commander, has been explaining that the Ghana, the Ghana Army, as well as the Ghana Police Service, the Ghana Fire Service, and other allied security agencies are trying to bring themselves together to be able to deal with election-related violence that sometimes characterize elections as we've seen in previous years. And so they want to do a simulation exercise in parts of the country to assess the preparedness of these security agencies to be able to respond to such issues as and when they, they come up in the lead up to the election. So the Brigadier General, the actually the commanding officer of the Southern Command here in Accra, is saying they are putting together these teams who are going to hold a simulation ahead of this election mm -hmm. to be able to assess themselves and their preparedness. So, could you give us a, a, a mental picture of this simulation exercise? Exactly what did they do today? Because if it's a simulation exercise, it is something they are looking to replicate on the day of election, perhaps. Give us an idea what you yes. saw today. So, so, today was the launch of the simulation exercise. It's not actually started. But okay. today, you could see the military men, the Ghana Police Service, the Fire Service, and all other allied security agencies who were there today with their arms and other accoutrements that they have as they prepare ahead for the election. So they've been having some of these things, they've been using it, they've been displaying it to the public, as in trying to reinforce into the minds of the ordinary Ghanaians that they are very ready to prepare and give them the best of security ahead of the election. Of course, the Brigadier General made a point that this is a security issue, they're going to do a simulation, they don't want to put entirely what exactly they are going to, to be doing outside in the public domain. But then they're going to hold some of these simulations in parts of Accra before the election, and then it will in, in, impact how they are prepared ahead of the election. Mm. Well, Kweku, thank you very much. Uh, we'll see what happens uh, going forward. And that is Kweku Asante, they're reporting from the Ghana Armed Forces uh, um, headquarters today, where they launched the Operation Easting Shield, essentially preparing towards the elections.